Hey guys, so this is going to be my April favorite and I'm not going to talk so much I'm going to go straight with the products that I've been loving last month and I'm just gonna randomly um, Show you what the products I have been loving and I'm gonna start with my hair care and I've been using this Nexus Salon Hair Care Youth Renewal Plump and Lift Blow Dry Spray for thicker looking hair and weightless volume that lasts all day. And it does really work on my hair because I use this like whenever so I blow my dry favorite my hair. cleanser last month. This is uh, Pure Lee's Pure Delicate Gentle Soy Milk Cleanser and Makeup Remover. <laughs> And I have been loving this too. I actually took this to my recent trip to the and Philippines. Um, I've been also using this Lancome Tonic Con Confort Lotion. Or, so it, like, it looks like that. If you can read that, I can't really read it. It's kind of hard to pronounce. And basically, this is just a toner. And I have been loving this last month. And I use this whenever I... Wa after I wash my face, I use a toner. <laughs> Apply. And then... Also, I have been also using this H uh what is this H two O skincare. This is just basically a um, Oasis mist, and then you can use this like after makeup or before makeup all over your body, or you can just use it for your face. And I actually found this at Marshalls, and I was like that. And then my favorite lotion last month is this one, the Shea Berry Breeze body lotion from Lush I think and and then my favorite perfume last month is this um what is this again Salvatore Ferragamo in Canto and I lost the cap of it and I don't know where it went this is just basically a small you know size of it it's kind of like real, really really cute I love the whole packaging of it it's, it's like amazing I found this at and TG then Mac. next thing I have been loving also is this well this will be forever in love anyway, so this is not really favorite anymore. This is going to be my, um, one of those things that I can't live without. Yeah, this is a brow, um filler which is from wet n wild ultimate brow kit that i've been loving and then i also been loving this whoop, um nyx mega shine lip gloss in what is this now in pink rose and i also um bring this with me to my recent trip and i love this um lip gloss it just gives me that nice um you know kind of like a peachy glow to my lips and has a pink tone to it and it's just and nice. then the next thing I have been loving also and I took this with me to my recent trip to Philippines is my Too Faced um, Natural Face Natural Radiance Face Palette and this is just basically a traveling um, a travel size palette stuff and it got it has a uh, mirror in it and a um, bronzer a cream blush and um, a blush right there a powder blush a uh, brightening um, brightening concealer and a concealer and this one is a lumini luminizer right there. It was my first time using Too Faced and I know that I love Too Faced now so I'm going to have to buy more of their products. <laughs> and they're not that they're not that cheap. They're kind of expensive, but they're worth it. Anyway, the next thing I have been loving also which I took with me to the Philippines are these brushes from Elf and I um this is basically just like I use this as a powder brush and this one is just for whatever you know i actually have like two of this and yeah i the other one is just for um liquid foundation and this one is just for uh broad i mean you know whatever like um blushes and stuff like that so i am in love with these two brushes they're very useful to have whenever you go travel or go places and stuff like that and I recently just purchased this um, knockoff of Beauty Blender. I just want to try what's the, um, you know, what's the hip about, you know. I mean, before I buy the Beauty Blender, which is kind of expensive on my range. And um, so I was like, yeah, maybe I won't like it. So maybe I found this at Marshalls and this is Love just for body. product. And then I also have been using this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in, what is this? Uh, San Paolo and I love this product it doesn't dry up your lips it's just like you know it's amazing I thought it would dry up my lips and um, I love that color right there it just stays on your lips for a few hours I would say like four hours tops for me and I have to reapply it again and before you um, if you want to purchase this or you have 
um, own one of these. Before you apply this to your lips, you actually have to uh, moisturize your lips so that it won't, you know, dry up. And it helps makes your uh, makes this last longer without your lipstick getting dry. And that's how you explain. And then my favorite blush last month is this uh, Elf Baked Blush in Passion Pink. And I love this blush a lot. And I kind of like, you know, use a little bit of it. And not only, I mean, if you don't want to have too much uh, blush on your face, but you still want to have a glow a little bit, this is the color for you. And I purchased this at uh, Elf website for three bucks, I think. And there, and then the, this is from their studio line, and I am in love with this and the other colors too. But mainly, I've been using this like last month because, um, you know, it's springtime, and um, I just kind of like get off from the um, heavy blushes because. I'm that way and you can also use this for everyday use too because it's very light and it just give you a dewy finish look at that a second see it just give you a dewy finish like that it's just re really perfect for um, this time too and I'm probably gonna use this on summertime and then my favorite bronzer last month is the Saint Lucia from elf again and you've seen that the name is pretty much gone because I also used this in my recent trip to Philippines last last March. And so this is the only bronzer that I took with me to my recent trip. And this is really nice because this doesn't show that much. You know, when you use this, it's like basically very light on your skin. It doesn't look like a bronzer bronzer that's like heavy in your face and you feel like... I mean, you you um you know feel like you're using a bronzer. This is like your own Stuff. glow. And then the next product that I'm gonna be showing is this um, Neutrogena Healthy Skin Enhancer. This is basically a liquid foundation, and it has a retinol treatment, SPF 20 moisturizer, and it has a sheer tint, which is all I have been using too. Is this Neutrogena Skin Clearing Mineral Powder? And it has a micro clear technology and I'm in the shade of nude 40 and I love it and I just recently tried this last month and I, I thought I was going to take this back when I was like oh my gosh this is very nice on my face. I mean I'm definitely blown away by Neutrogena products like this elf conditioning lip balm with it has a SPF 15. This is not the shade that I've been using that much and this is in peaceful peaceful pink and the one that i have been using constantly last month is the um the watermelon i think no what is it it's not watermelon no um it's in my car and i've been like, love loving and i'm in love and i actually have different shades of this and i just like this brand and i have two shades that i've been using last month too and i just don't have the other one here and this one is from ysl and i love their packaging and this is in uh Rouge Bullet Tea Shine. I'm not sure if I pronounce that well, but this is just basically a um, a pretty pink, has a coral color in it. I mean, tone to it. And lately, I've been using this kind of stuff. And basically, this is just kind of sheer on your lips. You see that it looks like a lip balm, but when you use this, it you know it just basically makes your lips moisturize and it lasts like a good hours. I'm actually wearing it right now and I'm just in love with this um, color because um, I love YSL lipsticks and I have two um, lipstick of this like I said that the other one is not here and I'm in love with that color too and um, I purchased this for like 30 something bucks I know it's kind of expensive but it's really worth it because not only gives your lips a moisturized you know feel to it but also lasts a long time my favorite concealer last month is the none other than eclipse palette from um coastal sense this is 15 concealer shades and you guys know already that i've been in love with this and using this console so and then we're almost there and then the next thing i have been using last month is this avon eight in one eye palette and this is basically a shadow with um has a um eight um shadows in it and it has a dark 
darks right darks right there and he has pinks right here and this is the highlights up here and they provide you with a um a um a shadow stuff right here what is the name of that one to um if you lost your applicator or something oh yeah it's applicator and then it has a mirror right here excuse me um it has a mirror right here so i'm just in love with this because um it does gives me a glow look on my eyes and i don't normally just use this alone for eyeshadow sometimes i just use this for um you know like a highlight to highlight my um inner corners and basically i just use this for that purpose and then the next two products that i've been loving are this elf eye primer and liner sealer and i can't live without this and this is basically my go-to products whenever i um do my shadows i pro i mean an eye primer and i use this constantly and this is just um i think this is just three bucks in their elf website and until now i'm still using it look how much product you get like look at that i mean this is an awesome primer it helps your eyeshadow last a long time and it's just amazing 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 i can never stop saying amazing because not only you get a primer but also you get a sealer for your liner three bucks people okay so the last thing that i've been loving is this what is this elite paris matte liner and this is in the shade of um i'm pretty sure this is brown oh matte brown and i actually got this in my glossy box last month and i never have tried anything like this before man i am in love with this when i try this and i was like i always want to try a um color brown eyeliner and god did answer me he sent me one for free for a um you know a good full size of this and amazing this is really good liner and i'm wearing it right now and it is it is it lasts a long time it doesn't like you know transfer or anything like that it's just amazing and now that i'm you know trying this i'm obsessed with brown liners i actually don't like wearing uh, black liners anymore you know because this just gives your this just gives your eyes like a natural your natural you know line liner if you can understand that ah, i'm not sure uh if you understand that one anyway so that's pretty much the stuff that i have been loving last month and you guys I miss you all so much. I'm so sorry if I haven't been doing so much videos lately. It's just that I'm so busy and you know it's um, spring cleaning time. So we have been doing yard stuff a lot with me and my husband and we just got back from our you know recent trip from Philippines and so you know we're just so busy lately and so I'm gonna be doing more videos lately in the future probably after the spring or i'm gonna keep doing videos and um i'm just so sorry if i haven't been doing so much videos so anyway thank you for watching i'm so happy to be back aren't you guys happy i'm back anyway 